I think people don't understand the question, and that might be part of the problem. I feel like a lot of people aren't quite sure what the confusion is about. The current confusion is not the rules of how we get converted, or how we even ask for mass conversion. It is what are the rules for somebody to be eligible for us to ask them to convert us, for them to be on this list, the request to mass conversion list. We need to know the requirements for that. What gets somebody on that list? That's what we need to know. Hey, Red Nova. Right, uh, hours pass, uh, excite with no excitement. My soldiers look at me, waiting for orders. Wait it out and trap it. And can we ransom anymore? No, none of these people are eligible. Okay. Lame. Uh, oh. We all fought the best we could. Finally brought the beast down. Loud cheers. Is she gonna like us more? Please. No opinion gain yet. In that list, do a manual search. Why would that work, though? It's only going to be a list of the people here. Like, if I... There's no way no one on Earth starts with an N. It's probably just taking an N because there's an N in his name. See? Like, that's that's not how the search engine in this video game works. That's just a search engine of the people already on the list. Try my best, at least. Oh, partly silently. Oh. So the person had no interest. Great. God damn it. Right click one, ask for mass conversion, see what does it. That might be a good answer, Heron Era. I like that. Um, what? Okay. <laughs> this guy usurped a Catholic, uh, some Catholic shit. Okay, cool. That, I like that idea though, Heron Era. Request mass conversion. Uh, no, because that's just telling us. Yeah, and then it's just if he'll say yes or no. Yeah. Here we go, hold, hold on, hold on, hey, hey! Heron Era find, found the hidden fucking menu! Just walk into a synagogue, that's what it should be, right? Heron Era found the fucking hidden menu, okay. So the score, it's base 10. Okay, so there's distance from realm, we don't need to worry about that, we border. Uh, there's their opinion of us, don't need to worry about that. Relative size of the realm. Now, how does that work exactly? Is our realm being bigger than theirs bad or good? I don't know, because we're both really, really big. We're actually similar sizes. Do we want to be bigger than them, smaller than them, or equal size? Um, they need to b belong to a proselytizing religion. See, that's probably a problem, because uh, Judaism, that's not a proselytizing religion. Um, if I understand my, my Jewish lore correctly, um, they actually have a rule about not... They don't try to shove Jewish shit on other people. It's, um, you need to come to a synagogue to learn. Uh, they don't shove it down throats. And is an emperor is plus five. Uh, that is to say he is an emperor. Which helps slightly. Uh. Let's give him a kingdom. I'm, mm, I'm not, but it still probably won't be good enough if I give the fucker a kingdom. Do I want to take that risk? If I were to say do it, I'm not I'm not going to, but it doesn't cost anything, does it? I mean it might. Mm. Will it be enough? Fuck, so many people in the chat are saying for me to give a kingdom. Okay, hold on. What kingdoms could I make? I could make Poland. I could give Poland to this guy. All of Poland and all of the land within. Judaism is against, yes, in Judaism is against the rules of the religion to proselytize. Yes, that is correct. Um, what's the smallest kingdom I can make? Uh, I mean, uh, no, it's not, that's a duchy. Okay, so it's Poland would be the smallest. I could give them all of Poland. I mean, I can't give him any land now, though. I needed my people to reconquer him. Because he's a foreign power again. So I guess at least 10 will to mask him. What, 10 counties? Do you know for sure? Because I need to know. And like, Judaism not being a proselytizing nation, is that a debuff or is it just a lack of a buff? I don't know. Because I can't ask this guy. 
I guess he's too small compared to me. He loves me, so that helps. Less opinion to mass convert. What do you mean? Seem to remember there is something in Jews only believe accounts if your father was one and if not you're not a real No, it's um the the rules of the Jewish religion is that uh you can be a real Jew no matter what, but they you are confirmed 100% a Jew no matter what, no matter how little blood you have if your mother is a Jew because you literally came out of her. There's no ambiguity about promiscuity because it doesn't matter if the mother was promiscuous. If the mother's Jewish, then you have to have Jewish blood in you. It's it's impossible not to be. That's, people are asking about rules of the Jewish faith. Titan security. Uh, what is this? Uh, a treacherous grandson is trying to escape to free someone. Eh, throw them in the pit. Man, uh, this is such a shit situation. Such a shit. Oh, worship the ancestors. I want... Pro uh, prosperity and growth for the realm. And just sacrifice someone from the dungeon. Mm. To the pit. Yeah, to the pit. Declared war. Okay, they're about to take the Jewish country back. Yeah, one of my vassals declared war on the Jewish country again. That's fine, because then he'll be my vassal again, or at least like a count or something. Uh, not even a count. And then I can give him Poland. Am I even going to be allowed to give him Poland? That's my big question. Will I be allowed to give him Poland? Because normally that's the thing that I get voted on, you know? If anything, I might just be splitting my land even worse, which I don't want to do. Put the points into motion. Hey, a hundred economic technology points. Nice. Okay, any second. That should be 100% victory. Are they going to peace out of that war? Here we go. And now he's just a guy again. Invite into my court? No. Where is he even? He's still there? He is nowhere. He loves me. False religion. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna buy a favor from him. For fuck's sake, 200? What if I wait? Because he's not counting him. Okay, nope, hold on. He's under someone else now. Now I can grant him land. So, I could, I could literally Maria. grant him a kingdom. I could grant him all of Bohemia right now, and all eight of the voters would say yes. Okay. Uh, we are going to give him, uh, we're gonna make Poland and give him all of Poland and see if he'll can. This is the stupidest plan. Let's see if we can do it. Thank you for following. Impossible to read name. Welcome to the flock. Hope you enjoyed the stream. This is so stupid. Okay, I'm gonna mark him as special interest so we can easily click on him again. This is so stupid. Okay. We're creating Poland. 200 piety, 311 gold. Okay, we've created Poland. Oh, it's gonna split the kingdom if we don't give it away right away. Alright, this dude. I'm gonna grant you all of Poland. <laughs> my vassals must be so confused. Oh my god, how is this gonna work? If this works, it's gonna be the craziest thing. And if it doesn't work, we can beat them. Poland isn't very good land at this point in history. We're still stronger. Bohemia still kicks ass. Did someone immediately resign and we just lost our diviner? <laughs> He's become the king of Poland. <laughs> okay, we have the king of Poland here, and then we have to grant him independence. Right? Because we can't, we can't ask him for, uh, we can't demand one from him, not that I'd want to. Uh, and yeah, he is not available because he's not a foreign nation, so we can't. Why you'd need to ask for a mass conversion from a foreign nation, I don't know. Why you can't just ask from an internal one? Okay. 
Uh, and then we are going, this is hilarious. I know, this is so stupid. All right, and I'm granting him independence. This is so stupid. This is so stupid if this works. Okay, we have granted Jewish, Jewish Poland independence. Okay, we just gave it a few days for it to update and everything. We can't ask. He's not on the list, it didn't work. Why? Why is he ineligible? Can you just not mass convert to Judaism no matter what? Now I've got a truce with him unfortunately, so I can't just declare on him right away. Won't work, the Jewish faith doesn't have the proselytizing trait. Do you know absolutely 100% Archmagenic that that is a requirement? See, now a few people are saying it who never said it before. So I just want to say, do you know for sure? Because I just want to point out that when I ask someone like this guy, it is a bonus that he's a proselytizing religion. He doesn't say that it's a requirement. There's nothing that says that's a requirement. I can't go to war with him right now. I have a truce. My, my vassals can go to war with him. I don't really care that much I lost that land, to be honest. It's not the biggest deal in the world. I previously tried, but I was being drowned out. It was very recent, though. It had to have been. But do you know 100% for sure? Have you checked the rules and there was a rule that says that? Because I don't want any hunches. I want rules. We've had too many hunches lead us astray. Like that one. Like that one we just did right there. That everyone in the chat told me to do. And I did. And I regret it. Alright, we, we do need a new chaplain now. Or a diviner, whatever. We'll just take a loyalist. Did you end up being a loyalist? You did. Good. That Jewish dude is fucking lucky. Oh my god. Just got- I can't believe my voters were okay with that. He is completely confused. Yeah. We're still going Jewish at some point. We're finding a way to do it. Like 100%. It's happening. Check if Orthodox are proselytizing. They should be. I'll double check. Yes, they are proselytizing religion. Apparently them being wealthy is negative for wanting to proselytize. Oh no, it's he has negative wealth. Okay. Maybe that's it. Well, we're bordered with a Jewish nation. Maybe that'll help. Maybe I want a truce with them. Maybe we need to like, maybe we need an alliance with them. Look, I just want to go Jewish. I just really want to go Jewish. Who are we swaying? We're swaying this person still, and she still doesn't like us very much. We still can't buy a favor for, for, from her. Are you kidding me? I could give her like an old out of date weapon. The plus two axe. There we go. I'm never going to use that. Yeah, it doesn't even give me any uh, prestige. I'll give her that. Charmer with elegant writing. Sure, because I'm a poet. Okay, she's still considering the thing. She did not respond to the letter. Cool. There, she took from the thing. The splendid object. Cool. Not the plus two axe. Yeah, we never used it. And, uh, by favor, she accepts, yes, 200 gold. Oh my god. Okay. Did, did she accept? She's considering. She accepted. Now, become a concubine. The answer is no. Because you're a claimant? Because you have a weak claim to something. Are you fucking kidding me? You weren't a claimant before. For fuck's sake. Okay, at least join my fucking country. I'll call in the favor to do that. What a waste of my money. You're an heir to... Uh, you are his heir plot to kill him, get Poland back. Good call before he's got a kid, yeah. Okay, she joined concubine. Okay, now you can't... Now she can't say no, because I'm her liege. There. There we go, she's my concubine. And we're swaying her. Uh, 
All right, let's now that we've given this guy everything in the world. Let's kill him <laughs> Well, he's a different religion, so it shouldn't actually be that hard finding people who will agree Is no one auto agreeing really no one hates him enough. Okay bribe this guy I can bribe him on the cheap and annihilate him immediately bribe both of them We need to kill him really fast before he gets an heir in fact, I'm moving my spy master over there to help. To build a spy network. Everything we do to kill him faster. We're at 202%. Poor Pollen. We need it back! Okay, he'll die by poisoned wine. Vassal's already declaring war on Poland. I want to re-inherit Poland. N See, the worst part of this, we still have Poland, so Poland will still go to another vassal when we die. It'll be in the, our empire, at least. But it'll be a problem. A bunch of my vassals are declaring on him. Hey, he died! Yay! Why did it not go to me? I'm his heir. It went to this guy now. I'm not his heir. Why am I not his heir? Okay, well, I don't have a truce with this guy. So, I could just start claiming shit. I could force vassalization in his whole country. <laughs> no, I want to conquer the thing. Can't claim the whole country, though. Maybe you can secretly convert through concubine. I don't believe I can secretly convert through concubine. I can! Yes! Yes! Okay, uh, does it take a moment to do that? No, we are officially a Jewish Israelite. Uh, I would like to go public. What are the requirements to go public with that? Or is it here? Uh... Personally adopt faith. Um, give up on the- no. Renounce secret faith? No. Give the shroud of the false religion you've been acting upon and declare your true faith. So that would be declaring myself Jewish. Yes! Yes! This stream has been insane. What the fuck is going on in this stream? Now, what I could do is try and start, like, a secret Jewish cult, right? Like, this guy is getting voted in right now. I want to... How do I start a religious cult? Not in a society. I need to leave my other society. Ooh, I hate leaving the champions of Purin, but fuck it. I'm leaving. You'll not be able to join another one for 90 days. How old are we? 71. Ooh. No, we're not going to live long enough for the secret cult. We got to just go public and hope for the best. We're going to do it. There. We did it. Our UI is a different color and everything. We're Jewish. We did it. <laughs> this is so dumb. This is so dumb. Oh my god, I love this. We can celebrate Passover and everything. Build the third temple, create Israel. Can't create Israel yet. Wow. We're a reformed religion, everybody. A reformed religion that not a single vassal of our entire country is. Oh my god. This is incredible. We have a court rabbi? Is there, Are they just gonna immediately? No, we actually have a court rabbi, okay. Uh, we need a better one than that, though. Can we start bringing in a bunch of Jewish people now? Okay, so we gotta reset all of this. We want join court, yes. And I want my religion. We can just bring in a shitload of Jewish people. Let's just bring in a shitload of Jewish people. So we to just flood the country. Jewish people start giving out the land to Jewish people so they'll vote for us. <laughs> this is amazing. This is so dumb. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do this. Let's just bring in every Jewish guy we can. Hell yeah. Oop, that went off screen. <laughs> Ugh, come on, game. Here we go. Check if Poland wants to vassalize. Almost definitely no, but I'll check. Uh, offer vassalization. I cannot because he is not at peace because he's at war with my vassals. Okay. 